How's it going guys? My name is Alex. Good evening. And welcome to my comprehensive guide review of my team that I'm playing with the Outwide playstyle. So as you know, I'm using this Guard Southgate manager. I just decided to buy him, not necessarily the best manager for Outwide playstyle, but regardless, good thing that I bought the pack and good thing that Kami is introducing featured players this season. They are already boosted to the maximum. Whatever, 90 is more than enough. Uh, like spend all their uh, training points on their actual stats and forget about being worried about the playstyle. So this playstyle compatibility is important so make sure when you're building a team maybe you need to build a brand new team maybe you need to buy a pack as you can see i have 1100 coins i'm just getting the coins karami is giving to us karami is way too generous with that so buy a pack and then you will have all the players fit in the playstyle let's talk about the playstyle itself i mean there's a few formations and i'm not talking about these just because i just came up with this i'm using uh lf FL, I'll be leaving the link in the description, the channel. Uh, when you talk about uh, the outway playstyle, the 433, 451, 442, 433, 352, and 361 uh, are all good for the outway playstyle. The problem is that we can't really change the positioning of the players manually, like we can on the console, but on mobile, of course, you can use some tricks and I explained in my previous video how I managed to achieve this formation. This is like a 4-4-2, but with a second striker in here. So very nice. I have to fold him. He'll be cutting inside. The difference between 4-3-3 and 4-4-2, uh, especially when talking about outfit playstyle, is that you probably would want to have a right midfielder on the right and left midfielder on the left, who are left-footed uh, on the left, of course, and right-footed on the right accordingly, which is making sense because you're going to be crossing a lot. So this is how you're going to be crossing the uh, areas uh, where your strikers are going to be uh, making their runs and they're going to be scoring a lot of goals like get used to that you'll be cross pumping merchant it is what it is it's a very effective way to score goals sometimes you need that but in the middle you will be feeling a little bit of a void in the middle there is no attacking midfielder to cover that spot that's a problem not big of a problem because uh sometimes uh this second striker if you have like a whole player uh, or a creative playmaker uh, there'll be feeling that void from time to time. I noticed even when I'm playing Marcus Rashford over here as a second striker or even a center forward, he's going to be dropping down. So this positioning of that second striker a little bit deeper is actually reflected on the pitch. And Kanami is doing their uh, justice to this uh, formation. But let's get into the game. Very, very good experience this season, I must say. And uh, it's still, it could be better, but Kanami is doing the steps in the right direction, more wins and essentially... Uh, more um, engagement for people, more wins, more rewards, people are engaged and they will, uh, it's all will boil down to people spending more money on the game and Konami getting the revenue and improving on the game. And so far, I'm real. I mean, uh, obviously, hands down, gameplay wise, this is the best game on the market right now uh, when we talk about uh, the mobile devices. And the Foden is there with the some skill moves and maybe taking a shot and with his right foot this time. Jaden Sancho on the ball, and this is the outway playstyle where we're gonna be dispossessed here. No, we're dispossessing our opponent, Jason Sancho here. The standing cross, and uh, it's been cleared. And this is gonna be a standing cross merchant gameplay, I would say. Phil Foden taking a shot and scoring the goal. What a goal by Phil Foden! Que golazo! No! Yeah. I didn't expect it. I decided to take a shot with Phil Foden. I didn't expect his finishing to be so good there. I just was like, ah, oh, you know what? I don't want to square it. I want to take a shot there. And uh, it went in. And Jaden Sancho dispossessing my man. And what is this? Okay, passing it. Uh, key. My man is on it. It's, it's... Okay, so we, I mean, Trent Alexander Arnold defending well. It only can be in the game, right? Uh, we can switch it to Phil Foden, passing to Marcus Rashford, to Rashford to Phil Paul Scholes there. Paul Scholes making the run and being dispossessed, but we're getting the ball, a collective pressing, gegen pressing, passing it. Marcus Rashford, Marcus Rashford fighting for the ball, taking a shot, and oh, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> 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 What was that? <laughs> I mean, my man didn't even watch. Okay, so this is gonna be not a difficult game, I assume. But I mean, it is what it is. I want to show you. I want to show you this formation. Two it in at front. Two players up front. I'm making way too many skill moves here. Two players up front, and uh, let's see if there's gonna be a really a problem with having uh, some people uh, in the middle because they don't play attacking midfielders. There is no attacking midfielders in this formation. Phil Foden there. On the ball passing to Hurricane, this is one touch passing, is essential when you're trying to uh, create some new 
uh, maybe uh, build a net of passes and then of course this is the outweigh playstyle and it is based off the possession playstyle so it, you need to wait for the opportunities to arrive there is not going to be the penetrative runs of your players will be only caused by you okay look show this possessed fun this my by the way i feel like my uh corner technique has been nerfed this season um okay i mean we are all over our opponents we are getting the ball we are not allowing him or her uh, to get out of their uh, part to the pitch, which is nice, which is good, because if you don't concede a goal, great trend, defending, very nice. So yeah, this is the, uh, only the uh, worst one-two passes, uh, where you're forcing your player to make a run, pass and run, uh, like this, with Marcus Rashford, that is so close, by the way, uh, with Marcus Rashford there, uh, will be initiating the runs, the incisive runs into the open areas. Other than that, it's gonna be wait patiently building the pass and technique. Yeah, see, the problem is that I still don't have that. Okay, my man is just kind of. What is this lag, by the way? Uh, yeah, it's it's impossible to play, by the way. It's this lagging a little bit. It's I, you, I don't think that you will be feeling that when I'll be upon in the video, but the lag is actually killing me here. But uh, fortunately, we're not uh, losing at least at this stage of the game. So yeah, it's just like there's a problem, you don't have attacking midfielder, sometimes you'll be having trouble finding the spaces, um, finding the, uh, the build-up play through the middle. But this is the playstyle with a 4-4-2 as an alt-white playstyle uh, manager or player, I would say. Uh, it is better to find your players on the wings like that. Phil Foden getting the ball and the ref blows the half-time whistle. Alright, it's the second half, uh, my man is playing with Spain without s and uh it's uh I, i'm hoping that i'm gonna be scoring some more phil foden there passing into marcus rashford look marcus rashford threw on goal there we can maybe marcus rashford he can be performing some okay i mean i'm just uh i'm so rusty i haven't played in a while for uh, uh consistently you know what i'm i'm just starting to getting used to uh, the advanced controls again and uh, this uh, this is uh, the, my this is my excuse it's pretty much yes uh, this is my excuse but I'm trying my best you can see ah this was so good Jane Sancho still picking about the ball the, the the controls not responsive I don't know why my Jane Sancho was standing there I already uh, input the input was there uh, the game apparently thinks that it wasn't he hurricane there passing into Marcus Rashford Marcus Rashford in this possession I'm just running into people there uh, okay Daniel Olmo switching it can we block this run by oh okay you see the lag is also present here for my opponent i don't know it's one of those games i don't usually get that uh, in this game but sometimes it is very very painful phil foden there with his left foot that was uh, that is why i'm playing actually the key that's why i'm playing luke show passing it and the keeper clears that's why i'm playing left-footed players on the left and uh, i can obviously uh, crossed with their stronger foot and more chances of the ball being delivered. Not the case there, but at least uh, at least I'm not. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm getting more chances of scoring a goal, so that's all I need. So outward playstyle, I only played with my Real Madrid team before, and I made a video about that. Uh, my Real Madrid build up, uh, but uh, I haven't tried it uh, a lot this season. I usually played with possession because this is a reliable way to play the game. Outfit playstyle is not that bad. You need to give it a try if you want something new in this game. As Marcos Rashford fighting James Sancho, who is completely out of juice here. But maybe just Sancho passing it to Hurricane. Hurricane taking a shot and scoring. No, but... Uh, <laughs> what is this game? <laughs> what is this game? What are these goals that I'm scoring? I can't, I mean, come on, this is absolutely ridiculous. Uh, not necessarily a, dis a good display of how this team plays out, but you notice that was like a quick counter scenario, right? My players were really ready to make the runs in decisive areas. As Kane, oh, this is what I didn't like. I didn't like how the run was actually not parallel to uh, Hurricane. It was like straight in the same line. So the pass was absolutely, okay, we're getting this absolute massacre. This is gonna be a lot of goals in this game. And goalkeeper saves it's also posted. I just I am why am I so rushing here? Okay, so this is um a very one-sided game, not really a good display of uh, the outright playstyle, but I'm doing my best. And uh like I said, you need to give it a try if you want something new from this game. 
and there's a lot of other playstyles that I haven't tried. Marcos Rush with pass into Hurricane again. This one touch pass in pinpoint football between your strikers is essential, I feel like. Without it, you're not really getting a lot of scoring opportunities. I mean, maybe you can, but I feel like this is very, very useful. When you need to score a goal, one touch pass in between your strikers, good to go. But you can also find a space like that by Trent Alexander Arnold. A standing cross by Trent would be nice. Marcos Rashford taking a shot. Goalkeeper parries it. And Sergio Roberto clears, but Phil Foden is there. We're gonna be performing double touch here. Yes, very nice. Phil Foden. Phil Foden is double touch and taking a shot. And uh, what is this clearance again? Wow. Oh, if Phil Foden was. This is why I'm so used to the playing inverted wingers. What a fun game, by the way. And we're clearing the challenge. Such a fun game, and this is why I'm used to playing with these inverted wingers. And if Phil Foden was right footed, it would probably be going in. Regardless, a fun game, uh, not really a good uh, a position. I mean, I will be trying to upload better videos, but um, it is what it is. I'm uploading the ones that I played. Hope you enjoyed this one, and I'll be seeing you very soon. Peace.